on YouTube, it is Sports Friday, welcome back to Geek Life! Alright, let's get down to today's video. So as I said... As I said, today is Forest Friday. Uh, so basically every Friday or every fr other Friday or so, something around that, I'm gonna do a video called Forest Friday. It's basically gonna be kind of a vlog thing, sort of, except it's going to be more Star Wars themed. Um, yeah, so welcome to episode one of Forest Friday. And basically every Friday I'm just gonna talk about Star Wars in general. Um, this week I'm going to talk about lightsabers. So, ever since I was a kid, I've loved Star Wars. I have a, a decent size, decent sized collection of play or toy lightsabers, such as this one, which actually is two that connect together. And if you are curious. I did get this at Disney World last year, last spring break actually, um, at the Bill Joan lightsaber thing in, by Star Tours. Um, well, they have them um, one um, in Magic Kingdom somewhere. I forget where in Magic Kingdom. There's one there. There's one in by Star Tours, and we got. Hollywood Studios, I think is what that's called. Um, and then there's one in Disney Springs, and there's supposed to be one somewhere else, but I forget what the other one is. But anyway, you can basically choose. This is a double deluxe, but there's double deluxe. There's just a double where you don't get the Kylo Ren things. There's um, deluxe, single deluxe, where it's a single lightsaber with a Kylo Ren, Kylo Ren thing. And then there's a uh, just single where it's just a regular lightsaber like this um, basically they give you the hill go on the line pick your own pieces and whatnot um, it's really fun so you know pieces just come off and stuff so you might be thinking well it's dedicated to lightsabers and you're just talking about toy lightsabers what about real lightsabers well I'm here to say they exist today. They're it's very uh, they're very they're not very common because they are pretty hard to build. Uh, they're pretty hard to harness the energy to make the plasma just go straight out. However, there are some. Uh, if I can find a link in the description, if I can find a link, I'll put it in the description. But I'm not exactly sure where I found a video, but I did find a video of t a guy who built one, and then some guys who are Star Wars enthusiasts who just um, went ahead and uh, played around with it and stuff and it burned jackets a little bit but it really didn't do anything because it kind of just like had fire along it and then it went out like that or like like that there we go I can snap jeez um, but they built one it was really really cool um, I hope to build one in the future as well um, but I'll talk more about lightsabers and how they um, how they work in real life in another um, video, specifically in another series as well. Actually, uh, basically, where I'm going to talk about technology um, that could exist in the future or that exists today. But for right now, I am going. To, well, for right now, this is what I'm going. This sounds gonna. Talk about one not, and I'm really trying to figure out how to do on iMovie because I have a gaming PC right there. But I don't use that to edit. I use my MacBook, which is right behind me, to do all my editing. So I'm trying to figure out how to do the lightsaber effect. Um, if I do figure out how to do the lightsaber effect, I will make a video on. Um, well, I'm already gonna make a video in the future on how to do an iMovie, how to do Star Wars themed videos or Star War, your own Star Wars movies and hopefully I'll figure out how to do the lightsaber effect in there um, once I do I will definitely let you guys know because I am not entirely sure on how to do it yet um, but yeah I 
Star Wars Force Friday Episode 1 is now complete. Catch you guys in the next one.